P.O.P., Mr. Rock the Mike News dot com, Mr. Ticket of the Week, every Sunday on 103 Jazz, 9 p.m. with your boy DJ Jack of Spade. This is the Hot Topic phone of view. And I have the talk of the whole scene movement on the phone right now. There's a lot of questions. There, 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 there's a lot of, we're going to call it a misunderstanding probably from the boss. But outside of that, man, he didn't just come on the scene yesterday. He's been signed to G-Man Entertainment. He has three classic mixtapes already under his belt. Before he started the appetizer series, He's on number three on the appetizer series, which just dropped. Get that on that piss. He's an incredible battle rapper that doesn't get enough respect. I'm talking about superstar Sal. Sal, what yeah. up, man? What's going on, Pete? It's been a Good. minute, man. I'm, I'm sorry the, the, the buzz of this record brought us together, but we should have been <laughs> had this combo, you know what I mean? What's <laughs> yeah, up with man. you, man? <laughs> Look, I'm man, cool. you, are the, you are the talk of the town today, my brother. Everybody is talking about this control freestyle. Uh, you did a Kendrick Lamar in a sense. Um, a lot of other ones dropped from the city. A um, couple of them, you know, got some looks. I don't think anybody got the jaw-dropping, the aggressive talk. <laughs> you know, I don't <laughs> think anybody got this much attention. It's probably because you were, you know, directly addressing. I'm going to call it, you know, basically the current news. Like, I think I feel like you address a lot of guys that, you know, move. I don't think the other joints either didn't address anybody and, or they just went straight, you know, they played it safe. But you didn't play it too safe, Superstar <laughs> Sal. You kind of, oh, you know, you know what I mean? But before we get into that, let's just get into, you know, how do you feel about the title of King of Virginia? And did you mention it? And is that something you're claiming? It's a three-parter. Um, I, I mentioned it, but no, I, I ain't claiming King of Virginia, man. Like, I ain't even, I'm, I'm just doing me, man. I, ain't, I don't want to be king of nothing. Like you say, how, do you feel, how do you feel about rappers that claim King of Virginia? I mean, I think a lot of them just do it for publicity, you know what I'm saying? Like, they ain't no kings, man. Like, I mean, if you, if you want to mention kings, they got, I mean, they got to be, I mean, somebody that's way, way in another stature, like, from the, Timberlands and people that has already made it and is really making serious money off this crap and things like that. Like everybody else, just trying to get exposure from it. Or like you say, you know, you know what I'm saying? Publicity sells, not not publicity, but controversy sells. So right, you know what I'm right. saying like claiming king, you know, you gonna have a lot of people salty about it, and you know what I'm saying the responses you will get from it. You know what I'm saying you know controversy sells, man. So now man, let me I, ask I you this. No I, um, I started debate. We was debating on the debating on the social media, man. Uh, what about Pusha T? Can he not get the crown? Oh yeah, the yeah, music, yeah. Pusha T he's making a lot that. of he great music. That. Yeah, Pusha T. You know, I mean, he that. does it. He does it, but you know what I'm saying? I just, I'm just putting it out there because nobody really, you know, I'm just no, putting out the talk, opinion, and a lot of people don't salute people. You know what I mean? Yeah, I mean that's VA though, man. Like, I'm, Pusha T could claim that though. Like, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't, no, I ain't no hater, man. He could claim it because, like I said, I mean, from the clip, the clip came out when I was back in high school. You know what I'm saying? You talking about, right. I mean, he's still around doing his thing. He's still, he's good still, music. Yeah, he's still relevant. Right. He's still, still relevant. He's killing the game. Really, he's killing him right now. So, like, and he's he been, he, he been on the scene for a long time. He's about the only one on that mainstream from Virginia. So, he, he could claim that. But, you know, you know, you know, it's all, that, that comes with a price. You know what I'm saying? Claim the king of Virginia, man. Absolutely. His rap was on every corner, man. Now let, now, now, let me ask you this, Sal. How do you feel about the whole Kendrick Lamar move with control? And um, you were you you were in, um, well, well, let's 
state it. Let's state it. And we're going to go to the second part of that question. How you feel about that control free style, man? What, the Kendrick Lamar joint? Yeah, Kendrick Lamar, yeah. Yeah. Um, I mean, it was all right. I mean, he, like you say, I think he, because you see, he ain't responded to nobody yet, and he got a million and one responses. I feel like right. it was a genius move. You know what I'm saying? It was a, you know, it was, it was a, like a publicity stunt, in my opinion. You know what I'm saying? Right. Right. Hip hop is competition. That's how I looked at it with my, my control, you know what I'm saying, verse. I wasn't going to do a control verse to speak on mine. My people came to me like, yo, I think you should go and do one and address, you know what I'm saying, address a lot of the issues. Because I go through a lot, man. Like, if you follow me and know what's going on, I go through a lot, you know what I'm saying, being that I battle rap now. And I get a right. lot of shots thrown at me, man. And, like, I just felt that's why I did mine. I feel like Kendrick, I mean, and I, and I got it. I did from Kendrick. Like, it was, it was like, yo, that's a genius move, man. Controversy so, so, always go sell. So go out, you know what I'm saying? You, you, you already know the story, man. <clears throat> so what, what, what brought you from battle rapping to get inspired to drop Appetizer 3, continue this series, you know what I mean, give us a lot of records, and what inspired you to put this control freestyle out? Because you could have just left it on the tape unknown, but you know what I mean? You wanted to drop this joint, you know what I mean? What, what inspired all that, man? What was the game plan? Um, with the control for like you said, my people's hit me up and were like, do one, man, cause, cause like I said, we talk all day long and they know about all the issues that I go through, like far as the respect. You know what I'm saying? I feel like I don't get the respect that I deserve. I mean, a lot of, I, I mean, it's, it's, it's plain to see. I don't get the respect that I deserve out here basically because of the way I move. You know what I'm saying? I just, I move on my own, I move on my own lane, man. I don't kiss nobody, you know what I'm saying? Tail or nothing like that, man. I just move on my own lane and I respect everybody. That's the whole right. thing about it. I, I show I show respect to every artist around here, man. Everybody, because you see a lot of the responses, people are like, yo, Sal a cool dude. You know what I'm saying? Like, right, I respect right, him right. as a rapper, and you got certain, I mean, I, I've been getting all good responses, not to be funny, but, I mean, you got the one or two, oh, I ain't like it, it was whack. But, you know, that, right, that comes right. with the territory. But I respect all, and even the MCs that I said something about in the song, I respect them, but I was shot first. That's what people need to know. Anybody that I said they name on that record in a negative light, I was shot first. That's why I sent the shot at them. Or mm. I would have, or I would have shouted them out like I shouted everybody else out. Mm. You know what I'm saying? You see, the record wasn't just a negative record where I did. The, the, right. You know what I'm saying? I jump on the beat and just diss everybody. I got up there and shout, shout to such and such, shout out to such, because I rock with everybody. You know what mm. I'm saying? But the people that send the shots at me. I sent my shot back at him. I gave him one bar. Now, these people will probably come back in a response with three minutes for me. Or, or for one bar. I gave all of them one bar a piece. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I, just, I just got that off my chest. You know what I'm saying? A little, sent them a little shot and, and went about my way because they sent shots at me first. And that's, they won't know, oh, I'm, I'm going to pick and choose who I'm going to send a shot at. But we're like, we can get into the names and, and then I know it's a lot of controversy because some people, like I say, I'm getting, I'm getting, like you say, the, the messages on Facebook and the threats and stuff like that. People threat, and I'm like, yo, I ain't even this you want to join. You know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't even right, coming right. at you want to join, and you mad. You know what I'm saying? What are you let's, mad let, about? Let, look, let's solve it for the, the people. Let's go real mm. slow. Let's go bar for bar. They're not going to turn us off. They want to hear everything. They want to hear the explanation. Let's yeah. go bar from bar for the top. And then when I say stop, I'm going to ask for the explanation. We ain't got to go that far because I think towards the end it was all, you know, love. It was Big K. It was, you know, yeah, no, I'm no, you. you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it was a lot of, you know, I did records with, you know, the King Cheese Town. It was a lot of love at the end, so it ain't no explanation. We don't need that. Let's start. Mm. Give us bar for bar. Acapella. Uh. Yeah, the first bar, I, mean, I came out like, shouts out to Kendrick. He got everybody offended for claiming King of NY with well, me, I claim Virginia. Now, that line, I mean, I just, you know, just playing with words, you know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, you right. know that's going to get under people's skin. I knew the record was going to get under people's skin. So me even just saying I claim Virginia going to get under people's skin anyway and grab their ears. Like, oh, oh, this nigga claim. Like, it's basically a contradiction to what I just said earlier. I'm not King of Virginia. I don't want right. to be King of Virginia, but... You know, playing it to the grab and listen his ear. Okay, I'm claiming Virginia on this song. You know what I'm saying? That's what Kendrick, right. Kendrick Lamar knew he's not king of New York, but he, right. that, that was his publicity stunt. You know what I'm saying? Right. 
So, right. I mean, all right, for Clammy Kings, for me, keep I going. You ain't got to Keep going. I'm going to stop you. Keep oh. going. You ain't got to break down every single bar. Keep going. Oh, it's been a minute since I locked down the music scene. When I was grinding, major movement used to do their thing. Double XL was shining like a motherfucker. And Hood Platinum was this shit. Damn, where they went? Now, on that bar, because I, mm. I X, hit, X hit me up on... You know what I'm saying on Twitter, and and you know, and you would platinum. You know what I'm saying that's your you moving. You yeah, know, yeah, 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 we yeah, 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 yeah. That's the thing. He, you know, he ain't mad. That's love yeah, right yeah. there. That's ain't mad. You know what I'm saying we go way back. Walt T, that's my man. Like that wasn't no shot at all. And like, right. I, I, don't, I mean, some some people may take it that way, but X ain't got to be an X. Was just like, yo, that's, that was a good wake up call for me because, and I just felt like I. Miss it's the old time. You know how we used to do, like, when, when we first, when I first came along with G-Man and stuff, you, man, you used to see Hood Platinum in there deep. I'm talking about major movement be there deep. Mm. G-Man, we come mm. through. You know, it used to be a, it used to be a real scene. I'm talking about mm. you see X in the front and about 20 people behind them. You know what I'm mm. saying? You got Walker Bill. The golden years. Yeah. The golden years. You got, you got America doing this thing, killing this thing. I'm talking about, man, you know, now I'm with Hood Platinum hard. And I'm just like, it ain't like that no more. You know what I'm saying? Right. I mean, and, and anybody, anybody that's, that, that's no, you know what I'm saying, know what we're talking about, no, it ain't like that no more. Whether right. people stop doing the music because of personal issues or people got tired right. of the game, right. it just ain't like it used to be. That's all right. I was saying. It wasn't no, oh, Double XL fell off. Hell no, Double XL got a deal. Like, come on, man. Like, XL, that's the big homie, and I shout out to XL. It don't, that wasn't no shot. Well, what, what, what about the jokers that feel like you said something bad about major movement? Address them. No, nah, like you said, I mean, it's, it's the same as Hood Platinum. I'm like, yo, well, what, right. you know what I'm saying? What happened? You know what I'm saying? Like, what, what, let me bring that old feel back. Because Major Movement was a hell of a movement, man. Like, mm. I rocked with them from Big Bigs, came over to G-Man, and we, we rocked with them. Like, man, I, I rocked with all these dudes, man. It's just like, I mean, it. I mean, when you when you get out there and say certain things, I mean, without like that's why this interview good, where I can go and clear it up. It wasn't no shot at major movement, like it right. wasn't no shot at hood platinum. I don't have no reason to send no shot at hood platinum or major movement. I'm not itching for publicity like that. I'm doing my right, thing right. on the battle scene. I just, I just, you know what I'm saying, I'm going through a list of names of everybody. You know what I'm saying? And I say, I'm like, yo, I'm gonna just go ahead and shout out everybody that I rock with. And then when I come across the name of a person that, that sent a shot at me or whatever, I'm going to send my shot. Now, I understand because, right. like, I, um, we will get into it later, but me and Young X spoke on the phone earlier. You know what I'm saying? His bar coming up soon, but me and Young X spoke on the phone because he felt a certain type of way. And I had, mm. we talked, and I even apologized to Young X. Like, yo, if you felt a certain type of way, I ain't need for it to be a certain type of way. I didn't do Young X either. Listen, before we move on, man, before <clears> we move on, I'm going to just assume, this is a great assumption, man. Mm -hmm. I think what it is is people, rappers in particular, especially, you know, in, in, in our area, man, Hampton Road DMV area, they're not used to getting mentioned. So yeah, I think same, what it is it be, is... It be dry, don't it, OP? It be kind of dry. Is, yeah, no, no, no. Listen. It, it's very dry, and I'm and I'm the media speaking on it. It's very dry, and 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 it's like I think what happens is when you hear your name mentioned, you because you gotta understand, like people, everybody's in their own zone. Everybody has their fan base, small or large, and when you hear your name. You don't really know how to react because you ain't used to hearing it. You know what I mean? Like, it's, yeah, it's, yeah. It's, it's, it's a different position for a guy like a, you know, a double X. You know, he gets good and bad all the time. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know, for whatever yeah. reason, whether it's business or it's music. But when you have a guy, you know what I'm saying, and, they, and then, you know, the light is, it's, it's a lot of social media. You see what I'm saying? So he might get, yeah. look, look, man, um, I got the disc record out. Whoa, 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 huh? Hey, so you yeah. did. Like, like, cause I, you know, we not gonna rag and say who I talked to, but I, 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 I talked to a couple cats that was, you know, we was conversating about it, and a lot of them didn't hear it yet. Like, yo, I heard. No, listen to the. Let me send it to you. You know what I'm saying? Then they can't yeah. be back. Oh, all right. You know what I'm saying? That was. Yeah. He rapping. Yes. You know. So I think it's so used to. 
you know, 50 Cent, you started this, by the way. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. 50 they started, so used man. to the disrespect, you know what I'm saying? And and they're not used yeah. to the LL Kum, Kumo D days, you know what I'm saying? They're not used yeah, to Yeah, yeah, that exactly. You know what I mean? The days disrespect. where it's not, it's not disrespectful, but you can feel like you're the best or you can feel like, you know what, this is how I'm feeling today. But let's keep the bars going, man. I don't want to, you know, I don't want yeah. to interrupt. Let's keep the bars thought, going. What's next? Like, well, uh, Hood platinum with the shit, damn where they went. Back then the competition was thick. Nowadays it ain't too many niggas that spit. And then I then that's what I went out said Soprano, he nice, but me, I'm in another lane. He gonna make me show him who's a bad motherfucker, man. Now you with that explain, bar, you gotta explain that. <laughs> that was a shot. Now that was a shot. Now, now why a shot at Soprano? Now now this is why I said a shot at Soprano. Now okay. I had a battle with Young X. Or bless through a battle with me and Young X. I had okay. a button. You know, you know that footage never dropped. Never now, dropped. Right. Shout out to never bless. Dropped. I just played the now, record this Sunday. Bless. Drop the footage. Give it to me. I want to break it. Go ahead. But I, I understand why Bless ain't dropping. You know what I'm saying? That's why I did, in the next couple of bars, you see me hear, mention Bless, and I'm like, no, nah, I'm joking, like Joe when he roasting. But let me get back to the mm. Soprano. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. Then let me get back to Soprano. You might need to do, listen, you might need to do a Jay-Z and just drop the written lyrics. <laughs> yeah, I might have to because people, you know not, I mean? they listening, but they, they listening, right. but they take, every, like you said, it's Virginia. Everybody taking it as, oh, my name was said, so I was disrespected. I'm going to kill him. I'm going to shoot him when I see him. It's like, come on, bro. Like, I'm like, man, did you listen to the record or what? Man, you just see this behind it, but did you listen, man? That That's going right. to be the show that people don't listen to lyrics no more, man. It, it, it almost made me tired of hip hop, period, because it's like people do not listen to lyrics. All they want to hear is a club bounce and a hard beat and some old bubble gum. So they're not listening to lyrics because, honestly, I could say in my mind, for real, for real, maybe about five people with this and totally in that song, man. But Back to Soprano, right. I don't want to get all the way off topic. Back to Soprano. Only reason why I set a shot at Soprano is because of this. All right, me and Young X battle. Now, we all know he got the song, I'm a bad motherfucker, man. That's my shit, the two-step joint. Right, I right, fuck right. with that hard. He, he, he always, he all exactly, that shit hard. He always performed in that, at the battle events. Now, I'm battling with Young X, and we know that's part of Young X camp. And we know he going to be yeah, there at CRC, the battle. Shout out to CRC G Lens. Shout yeah. out to him. Now, why not incorporate him in one of my bars? Because you know that's going you know to get crowd reaction if I throw his name in one of my bars. But right. I'm not, I didn't diss him. I shouted the song out. You know what I'm saying? I'm about right. the two-step and I'm a bad motherfucker, man. But he wasn't there at, at the me and your ex battle. So you know how people is. They flipped it around and it got back to him. Oh, Sal diss you in a young ex battle. I didn't mm. know that somebody told him that. He came to the next Seven City or sh- Seven City Sharks event. I, I wasn't at that event. I wasn't on that battle card and I wasn't at that event. He performed the diss song and he dissed me. At, mm. no, at, at, the, at the battle with him. Mm. He, did, he didn't mention no battle rapper's name but mine. This is what I was told. And he said, he typed this on his own on Facebook. Yeah, only person I could have shot at was Superstar Sal. That's the only name I mentioned. And I, and I replied, I was like, yo, why was my name mentioned? What you diss me for? Oh, somebody told me you dissed me in a young ex battle. I was just returning the favor. I'm mm. like, yo, I ain't, I'm like, yo, I ain't diss you in the Young X battle, but let me go check this song out. I checked it out, and it wasn't nothing that made me like, oh, I got to respond immediately. I was like, oh, I heard it won't battle nothing for real, for real, but okay, Earth ain't Gucci. But me as a battle rapper in the back of my mind, like, you know, like, if, if ever the time comes right, I'm, you know I'm going to get you back. You know what I'm saying? That, that's, you know, that's Right, 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 right. As a battle rapper. I mean, rapper, I, I, did, I, I, I seen a, I, I seen a brief. You know, S- Soprano said thanks for the shout. He didn't. He didn't. He didn't. He didn't go crazy. Yeah, you know, he didn't go crazy. So, yeah, he, he, he didn't go nuts. He, he said, said he, oh, he cool. said he respond. He on vacation. <laughs> so it sounds like you might get a you might get a couple bullets. I'm gonna get a, I know I'm gonna get a response from Soprano, <laughs> but I respect that. But I respect that though, because that's grown men. Like keep it right. pop, man. This ain't me having right. no plea or nothing like that. But I'm a grown man. I got a family and stuff like that. Like if I came out there, nigga. I'm going to shoot you up, nigga, this, that, third, you a bitch, this, that, and the third, then I can respect you. Come, But all these little threats and stuff, like, I'm like, yo, man, I'm getting threats from niggas I ain't even said nothing to, and I ain't, I ain't, I, I ain't say nothing out of the way on that track. You would have heard it. I ain't say nothing yeah, out of the way on I that heard, track, man. Yeah, I, 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 I was, um, 
I was policing what I got, man. I didn't hear nothing too crazy. But keep going, keep going. Yeah, oh. okay. I said that about Soprano, and that's why I said Soprano right. shot, because he dissed me on the seven for shots shots and, and his performance. Then I said, right. Mike Mo decent, but he ain't focused. He's too busy Facebooking. Everybody know this. That was a shot. Now, right. <laughs> me and Mike Mo. Why you can't, Mo? Listen, listen. Mike Mo. And, and Mo will be on the book, Mo. So, <laughs> shouts out to Mike Mo. 